Hi everyone, my name's Savannah. My name's Ify. My name's Ella. My name's Omar. And today we're going to be showing you around Nottingham City. lucky in Nottingham because there really is so much to do. There is a whole variety of things you can explore, places you can go, things you can try. It has cafes and all sorts of restaurants, shopping, escape rooms, the ice rink, Willerton Park. There's definitely something for everyone. So I've just gotten to Old Market Square. This is like the main heart of Nottingham city centre. It's where you'll meet up with your friends, there's markets going on, the Christmas market is here, loads of random pop-up events and things happen. Sometimes they even bring like a beach into Old Market Square. There's lots of good shops around and it's really easy to get to the city centre. The transport links in Nottingham are amazing, you've got so many options. We have buses, an e-scooter company and trams as well. This is a tram stop near the back of the uni. So you can see behind me is the uni park, Lakeside is just about there. You can hop on the tram straight from campus, like that tram behind me actually. <laughs> You can see that some of the bus links are just down over there. The buses come so regularly. It's really frequent, cheap and just great. One of my favourite ways to get around Nottingham, whether it's to campus or to the city, is using these electric scooters. They're dotted literally all around Nottingham, so you can literally download the app, find the nearest one to you, and then basically start riding. I think one of the things I love the most is that you can actually walk from one side of the city to the other in a really short amount of time. But within that city there is so much to do and there's so much choice and diversity. It's just an amazing, exciting place to be. Nottingham has such a wide variety of shops. There are so many high street fans and so many great independent shops, charity shops, eco-friendly shops, all that sort of stuff. I especially love this chain of shops around the city called White Rose. They're charity shops that only specifically get clothes from high street brands, so they're great for students. We have just headed out to go vintage shopping. We went to Cow, which is one of the best vintage shops I've ever been to. They have such a really nice selection of stuff, all different colours, all different styles. I definitely recommend that you check it out. I also love the Victoria Centre. Victoria Centre is pretty big. <laughs> there are just so many shops and some of my favourite ones I've found in there that I've never been to before. And I love like the eating area in there, it's great. If you're someone from an ethnic background where you're scared that like you might not be able to find a lot of your very cultural stuff from back home, like herbs and spices that you might use. Or if you're looking for like halal food, you can find it at Victoria Centre Marketplace. One of the best things about Nottingham City Centre is that they have loads of different places you can go to eat and drink. You can really find whatever sort of food you're looking for. You can go to all like the high street chains if you want or go to more independent places. Just behind me there's an Italian place and then around here there's Indian tapas which I love this place. I tend to like to go to a lot of the Asian restaurant. The Asian population in Nottingham is quite large so they've got quite a lot of different styles of food here. As a Latina I was very happy when I found out that there is actually a Cuban restaurant in Nottingham. I really recommend the burgers or the enchiladas and the cocktails are incredible. We're so lucky in Nottingham because we have so many different types of coffee shops and cafes, so many independent places, but also like so many big chains as well. Like on every street corner, there's some sort of coffee shop. So we've got Starbucks, Costa, Pret a Manger. We've also got like independent places that are so good to go, like Fox Cafe, 200 Degrees. One of my favourite cafes to go to is called Ethy. It looks amazing, and the coffee there is so good. I went for a skinny vanilla soy latte. I'll give this a 10 out of 10. It's actually really nice. So 
So this here is the lace market and it's filled with charity shops, restaurants, bars, independent shops, cafes and things. And it's just a really lovely place if you want a nice diverse range of restaurants to go to. And it's also close to the ice rink which is at the other end of it. Nottingham's so rich in like culture. You've got the Nottingham Playhouse, you've got the Theatre Royale. You've got the recently reopened Nottingham Castle and Nottingham is also famous as a city for its caves. The Old Trip to Jerusalem is allegedly the oldest pub in England and it's actually carved into the rock underneath Nottingham Castle, which is really cool. If you're looking to watch movies, there is a cine world with an IMAX screen and there is an independent movie theatre centre called Broadway. Not only that, but I guarantee you that your favourite artists had gigs at many of the Nottingham menus from Motorpoint Arena to Rock City. Of course, Nottingham is also known for its amazing nightclubs and bars. There are also tons of cool cocktail bars and pubs. It's one of the best cities I can say to actually be going out, having fun in terms of drinking with mates, having fun at bars and just generally just having a good time. Another thing that I really love about Nottingham is that you really do have the contrast between sort of bustling areas of the city and then you've also got these beautiful tranquil green spaces dotted all around Nottingham. If the bustle of the city gets too much you can escape to somewhere a little bit quieter. My favourite green space does have to be Highfield Park just because it really is so peaceful. It's one of the most beautiful parks I've been to and because it's on campus you can really easily escape there whenever you need to. I actually walk around Highfields Park in between lectures so it really is accessible. Luton Park is literally right next to campus. In my first year I was in Derby Hall and it is literally across the road. You cross a road and you are there. So it's amazing to have such a big green space so close. We go for, out there on like walks on Sundays or my friends go running around the lake and things and there's loads of deers as well it's so cute there's also a lovely area by the river where you'll see people on roller skates on bikes and things and near there you also have the university's own boat club where they do the rowing on the river trent there's also the nottingham forest and Notts county football grounds as well as the where they hold the ashes And that's just about everything from me today. I really hope you enjoyed this little city tour that we've done today. There are loads of places to see, loads of shops to go to, and I really hope that all of you can come and be able to see and explore as much of the city as possible. I hope to see some of you guys in September.